Chaos Spinach. Nice. Okay, but for both difficulties, we're gonna go mean. I did. Alright, I'm in a cutscene. Me too. Oh, it's, it's the Monokuma. It's the banner. Take it, Rumpa. The massive high school. Who's gonna. I think this is the main character. Who wants to be the main character? Carter, heads or tails? Uh, tails. It's heads. Because I guess I will be him, or do you not want to be him? Uh, you can be the main character. Okay, so. It's saying they are the gated to ultimate school full of ultimate students. Was me. Before we go any farther, I guess I should introduce myself. My name's Makoto Naegi. Makoto? Oh, Pog. <laughs> As you can see, I'm nothing but a hopelessly average high school student. Average on the outside, average on the inside. I really don't have much going for in terms of grades, special abilities, and even personality. I mean, yeah, I have hobbies and stuff I like to do. It's not like I'm a psychic or mutant or whatever. Like, if you asked me what my favorite song was for a favorite movie or TV show, yeah, I'll just be whatever seems popular at that particular moment. He's a basic bitch. He's a normie. Red ass motherfucker. And the ultimate mentioned the ultimate Becker King Theater, too. <laughs> it's fucking Josuke. <laughs> it is. Then actually standing there in front of the school, I started to feel lost. Like, I didn't belong there. I could feel myself losing my nerve. But still, I can't just stand here in front of the gate for <laughs> Yeah, he's been standing here for like 10 minutes. <laughs> the gate's just locked. <laughs> Trying to play it cool, I took my first step into Hope Seek Academy. Also, my first step to starting a new life at a new school. At least that's what I was hoping for. Oh. Not neat? Well, just as I took that first step forward, Whoa. my view came warped, twisted. It's like some kind of delusion, melting away, mixing into something else. Spinning, mixing, melting away, then spinning again. Then the next moment, everything went black. That was how it all began. How life as I knew it came to an end. At that point, I should have realized. The reason I was brought to Hope's Week Academy wasn't because they had ultimate good luck. This is like experience ultimate despair. I'm the ultimate unlucky student. Not I'm not the ultimate student. lucky student, but the ultimate unlucky student. <laughs> What a twist! Da da da, da da da, da da da, da da da. Hmm. The normal classroom. This is that's where a window should be. It looks like some kind of metal plate has been bolted over it. And I was not coming. Yep, definitely metal. Thick too. Very solid. Sorry, I'm late. If much stuff happens, then all of a sudden I was just asleep. Huh? Do, do you want me to sky or should I? Uh, I'll voice this guy. Okay. Whoa, you too? Uh, me? I guess that's you then. Yeah, let's just keep switching off. Things just gonna keep getting curiouser and curiouser. Mm-hmm. I think you should voice this guy too, actually. <laughs> sure, strange. I declare beyond a shadow of a doubt that this is the strangest situation indeed. Situation. I can't do that voice. Um, what are you talking about? I honestly have no idea what's going on right now. Got it. Just a moment. There's something else we must address. Listen to me! Makoto, your tardiness is unacceptable. Surely you were aware this meeting was to start at 8 a.m. sharp. To be late on your first day is unspeakable. I must report you, and you must accept your due punishment. What? What's your problem? It's not like he wanted to be late. He didn't have any control over it. That's right. Everyone, just calm down. Listen, why don't we all go around and introduce ourselves? Huh? Are you voicing this? Are you voicing yeah. uh, Josuke or am I? I'll do it. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, the hell. Now it's no time for freaking and drugs and injections. Yeah, give him like a, a really, like, thick southern accent. Okay. For some reason. 
That's a good point. Um. Fuck. I already have like a valley girl. What's this one gonna be? <laughs> this is this is the pop star. I'm pretty sure. What voice should I do for her? Uh. That is an excellent question that you have to find the answer to. Fuck. Uh. Listen, this is this is only gonna get easier as the game goes on. Right, These right. People are gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it, she can be the same too. Okay, so let's get her drugs out of the way. Then we can move on to some whatever else. Sound good? World of two D. <laughs> well, in that world, I am well known as and purely well regarded as the ultimate fan pick creator. Mm -hmm. I cannot wait for this guy to die. <laughs> I am once sold 10,000 copies in one of my fan comics at a school festival. The event has cast me into a legend. <laughs> Someone didn't get it, of course, and I'd be tainted by the event. How stupid can you be? That's too bad about that. My lolly scat doujins sold really well at the school festival. <laughs> Selling 10,000 copies like that is definitely pretty remarkable. However, the words of said Yeah, 10,000 copies at a school festival is pretty remarkable. That is insane, yeah. He played for a national high school champ, so he's a clean up hitter. He's also a baseball star. That's the first athletic special specimen. <laughs> you? Seriously? Huh? Huh? What's wrong? I mean, when I found the article and picture of you alive, that's how he looked at What? Aw oh, man, you saw that picture of me playing baseball? Me, the baseball player? Seriously? I hate that picture. What the crap? This is so not cool. So not cool, seriously. It's like, I'm mega uncool, embarrassed right now. I kinda... My... Hell... <laughs> Fuck, what's the Mario line? It's like, hey, paisanos! <laughs> okay. Psycho like paisano. Wait, oh yeah, I'm her. I look forward to She's gonna to be known as Paisana. Okay. I guess I'll just give her a normal voice. Yeah, you're just gonna have a conversation with yourself right now. The way she moves is positively mesmerizing. With a pleasant set, I can't, I can't quite place. She's the ultimate writing prodigy. She's probably the worst in the fanfic writer. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> Dot dot dot. What's your problem? What? Well, it's not polite to stare, you know. What the heck? Stop staring at me like some, some filthy creature. F filthy creature? No, I just. Disgusting uh... black creature. No. <laughs> He's the ultimate moral compass. <laughs> He's the ultimate good boy. <laughs> anyway, you can call me Takai. You said your name is Makoto Naegi, right? That's a good name, a strong name. You should thank your parents for giving you such an excellent name. You hear me? And to keep that name from losing its value, you must devote yourself every single day. Got it. Life is worth putting every ounce of effort into it, right? Right? This guy is kind of annoying. Face. Nice to meet you too. Yo. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> no, it's it's Junko. Okay. I'm Junko Enishima. Charmed, I'm sure. Are you Junko or am I? I think you are, right? Yeah, I was Junko. Are we just seeing your dots, Carter? I did, I said dot dot dot. There's another dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. <laughs> um, can I ask your name? Dot dot dot. My name is Kyoko Kirigiri. Ultimate question mark. She's even been chosen as a fitting Olympic cadet. She is without a doubt the ultimate swimming bro. The combination of her ability, appearance, and um Booba has been widely discussed. Such a creeper. <laughs> so uh what was your name again? Sorry, totally forgot. I am Celestia Ludenberg. She's the ultimate gambler. Oh nice. I like her. I think she's best hero so far. Ludenberg. It is my name, but if you don't mind, I would prefer if you call me Celeste. Uh, he's the ultimate clairvoyant. <laughs> nah, I'm just, I'm just fucking with you. I'm just pulling your chain. 
but hey, we should grab some Brewski sometime and get real deep into Lemuria and its civilization. What? We're not the drink. We're in high school. Oh, he's such you such a know? bitch. Oh, I'm actually 21. <laughs> I've been held back a few times, so you will. Uh, it's a long story. Who's this guy gonna be? He's the ultimate affluent progeny, Sakura Ogami. I am Sakura Ogami. I'll let you handle this one. Okay, I'll handle this one. Um, what are you? I see. What are you? Muscular quality and quantity is right around that of an extremely ordinary high school student. Hmm. What a shame. Not at all fit to act as my training partners in this game. But then, if they can. Ding dong. Ping pong. Oh. Oh, it's him. <gasps> there he is. Ahem. Who's gonna be the bear? Testing, testing. Mic check. One, two. Actually, since the you're the main character, I'll be the bear. Okay. System. Am I on? Can everyone hear me? Okay. Well then. That voice seemed completely, uh, totally out of place. It's so playful, so completely unconcerned. I can help but feel a deep, unnerving dread at the sound of it. It's like hearing someone laugh at the scene of an accident. Uh, to all incoming students. I would like to begin the entrance ceremony at... Right now! Please make your way to the gymnasium at your earliest convenience. That's all. I'll be waiting. Da da da. Da da da. Oh, it really does look like an entrance ceremony. Yo! See, he told you it's totally normal entrance ceremony stuff. Heroes, right? Been in the way. This is emphasize. Emphasize. I can feel not normal all of us for. Hey there, howdy, hello. Is everyone here? Good. Then let's get things rolling. Cutscene. Oh, oh god. There he is. Looks like he has a dick. Uh, uh, teddy bear? I'm not a teddy bear. I am Monokuma! And I am this school's headmaster! Say what? 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 That teddy bear duck? What? <laughs> Calm down, I'm sure there's just a speaker inside it. Hey! Come on now! I told you already, I'm not a teddy bear. I'm Monokuma. I'm your master. Now, uh, um, make no mistake, you know, you're so full of potential. Represent the hope of the world. And protect such splendid hope. We would all live a communal life together solely within the confines of this school. Everyone will live in harmony together and adhere to the rules and regulations of the school. Oh. Regarding the end date for this communal life, too bad there isn't one. In other words, you'll be here until the day you die. Such is the school life you've been assigned. As I mentioned, in order to maintain an environment of harmony here, we rely on a communal lifestyle. And if someone were to disrupt that harmony, they and they alone would be allowed to leave the school. That is my student since the graduation of this. What? What do you mean by disrupt harmony? Who, <laughs> who? Well, you know. If one person were to murder another, M murder. Yes, indeed. Stabbing, strangling, bludgeoning, crushing, hacking, drowning, ignoring. How you do it doesn't matter. Crowd, you're kind of quiet. Must kill someone if you want to leave. <laughs> You just voice not came over like this. <laughs> a chill oh. a chill shot down my spine. You must kill someone if you want to leave. Since I heard these words, my blood went cold. Patrick is seven, huh? Like I said before, you guys are the hope of 
you know. Taking that hope, seeing it get creates a darkened shadow. <laughs> and I just find that so darn exciting. Dude, shut the hell up or get out of my way. Shoving in hero side, Wanda plays himself in front of Malakuma, his voice rumbling like thunder. You're fucking dead. Listen up, asshole. This shit's gone way too far. What the hell kind of joke is this? What's the matter? Joke? This is not a yoke. What do you mean, like your hair? You son of a bitch! It is just gay! Wanda roared out and there was a sudden boom. Sound of the floorboards as he kicked off and launched himself into the air. <laughs> it's the work of an enemy stand. He flew up Monokuma fast and straight as the bullet. He's locked onto his target. Gotcha, you little piece of shit! I don't know if you're a toy or a stuffed animal or whatever the hell. Either way, I'm gonna rip you to fucking shreds! What? The violence against the headmaster is in violation of school regulations! Shut the fuck up! Let me out of here, I swear to Christ! Beep boop. Hey, damn it! What? No smart ass comeback this time? Da, da, da. Piece of shit! Stop that goddamn behind! Say something! Watch out! Watch out! Get rid of it! Huh? Hurry up! Oh, that's you. Hurry up and throw it! I don't know if, if, if her ferocity stunned him into silence or whatever. Or what? Or what? But a word he did what he was told. He threw Monokuma. And as soon as he did. <laughs> Yeet the bear! <laughs> the hell? What the? That, that sure as shit wasn't a joke. It blew the hell up! I told you, I'm not a teddy bear. I'm Monokuma. Coomer. Monokuma. Wow, there's another one. D damn you. You son of a bitch. You see, they tried to kill me just now. Of course. Well, yes, I was serious about trying to kill you. You did violate one of the school's regulations, after all. I'll let you off with a warning this time. You better be careful from now on. Any naughty boy or girl who violates my rules will get off with just a little swat on the butt. 